All right, hey. This is more of a video diary than an episode. I'm just trying to document what is been a big step forward in my rib technology. What is rib technology? Rib technology is a method. It's a uh, procedure, if you will, to to cook a rib to its maximum potential, the potential to make people happy. And that's, that's really what we're trying to do here. So let me show it to you. There it is. This rack just came off the uh, barbecue tonight. And I think it's a huge step forward. It's just a huge step forward with the rib preparation. Now what we did we cooked it faster because what we what we had had going on with ribs is was like a three hour cook time three plus hours really and that's just really hard to schedule around this rack was done it is now nine o'clock this rack was prepared in an hour and a half it was started after 7 30 so the other thing that I want you to notice tonight is we're starting to create a bark, a sweet bark on our ribs, which was really missing in our other preparation. So here they are. Now I'm gonna try something a little bit different with the videos. You never get to see me carve them up. And you never get to see me taste them. And I think that's something that most people would probably enjoy. So I'm gonna actually sit the camera down at a weird angle and I'm gonna cut a rib or two off and then I'm gonna eat it just to show you what it's all about. So I know that's bad camera work, but here we go. And I'm just gonna start right here in the middle. Cut a couple off for um, tasting purposes. Okay. So there it is, my hands are a little sticky. Again, these ribs here are like some serious meaty ribs I got. Actually, I got these from Walmart. So here it is. I'm going to take a taste. I want to see, see how they turned out. We can see that they really got cooked through nicely. There's no pink or anything weird. This is pork. We want to, we want to cook it fully through. So here we go. Mmm. It's really good. It's not so cooked down that it's like pulled pork, but it came right off the bone. It's actually so meaty that we still don't get the full barbecue sweet taste I was hoping for. But hey, it was a good try. We're just gonna have to keep working to get the sweetness with the smokiness. These are awesome. I'd definitely pay for these in a restaurant. They're really, really good. But we gotta get them sweeter, we gotta get them smokier. So, video diary complete. I'll definitely be enjoying these ribs tonight, I can tell you that. So, that's the end. Bye.